Hey, what's going on? So today we're gonna do a little spray session. We're gonna be spraying some top water lures. Well, just one, just to show y'all. So let's get started. Now the first thing I do is I buy these little scrub pads. They're kind of rough. You get them at any grocery store or store. And I just kind of just scuff the surface of it a little bit. It gives the gives it something for the paint to stick good. And I make sure I don't drop it. Alright, that's pretty good. We got it nice and scuffed up. As I'm spraying the compressor's gonna kick on so you may not hear me. I'm not gonna talk. Alright, here we go. Nice even coat. Alright, we'll go ahead and heat set that with the blow dryer. You'll know when it's set because the paint will go from shiny to a flat finish. You can watch it happen as you're applying that heat. Alright, now for the next step, we're going to apply our mesh. I like using these little clips right here. They seem to work pretty well. All right, now I'm gonna take this fluorescent yellow and just apply it to the sides. A nice even coat on each side. Go ahead and after that's heat set, go ahead and clean the gun out again. All right, now along the backbone right here, gonna be putting this pearlized lime green. I use all Createx paints, and then also I use Wicked. Seem to work pretty well. All right, nice even coat along the back. Some more paint. All right, we're gonna hit the back with a light, light coat of gold. Just to accent it a little bit. Very light. And the trick to when you take your mesh off, after you take your clips off, you just kind of want to roll that mesh off of there. You don't want to drag it. Also use these taxidermy paints this is a shimmer in red I'll go ahead and coat the sides and the top with this all right once I got that heat set we'll go ahead and flip it over because we're going to hit the belly with another coat of white. Alright, we'll go ahead and hit the belly again with another coat of white. Just like that. We'll go ahead and heat set it. Alright, so the last color that we're going to do is we're going to paint the throat of it red. So the next step is I sign it 
and then we'll put some eyes on it And we'll go ahead and throw the eyes on it. All right, so after we get the eyes, we'll go ahead and get our epoxy. You want to make sure you dip it slow. And you put this little one at the bottom, it controls the drip. And we'll let that dry for 24 hours. And it'll be good to go. Alright y'all. So that's going to be the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Comment below. Let me know what you think. And all these lures will be available at rigpfa.com. I'll put the link in the description. I'm adding new inventory. I'm actually working on some right now. I've got these finished. I've got a bag of different ones right here. These aren't on the website yet, but I'm going to be adding them. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you next time. Peace.